In laboratories like this all over the world, scientists are trying to answer the same questions. How can COVID-19 be stopped? Is there a cure? When will this global crisis be over? At the Pasteur Institute in Tehran, Iranian experts are working with Chinese colleagues to try and improve testing for the virus, something that has been a challenge since the early days of the outbreak. Well, I'm coming here for uh, just help them to uh, uh, do, uh, give them some training and how to use the test because they are now uh, they are using all products here for the and testing. Could you please stop? I'm sorry. Uh -huh. no. Our interview with the visiting expert was cut short by security. The government here has been criticized for responding too slowly to the pandemic, and it seems officials in Tehran remain sensitive about anything related to its coronavirus response. Set up in 1920, the campus in Tehran is named for French scientist Louis Pasteur, a 19th century pioneer of modern medicine. This institute runs dozens of labs and employs hundreds of staff across the country. The government hopes research and development here will enable Iran to export diagnostic kits and medical equipment. This facility is nearly a hundred years old and one of the largest of its kind in the Middle East. For years, scientists in these kinds of labs have been fighting all manner of diseases, infectious diseases, and now their priority, the inescapable priority for these men and women, is to try to find a way to fight COVID-19. Why is the virus more severe in some patients? Does it mutate? And can survivors develop immunity? Answers to these questions and the discovery of a vaccine in a place named after a pioneer in the field would be an outstanding achievement. And the head of the institute made it clear that is the ambition. We are working on producing the technical knowledge for a vaccine and focusing on medicine and treatment to see which medicine could be a good candidate for curing the disease. But on the day of our visit, Iran's president was more guarded in an address to his cabinet. Hassan Rouhani was clear. There have been no breakthroughs. Social distancing is the best policy, and everyone's in this for the long haul. Based on the assumption that this virus will unfortunately remain with people for some time, and nobody in the world can predict when this epidemic will end, days, weeks, or months, we have to observe health protocols while continuing work, production, and activities. When it comes to corona, People have the major role. There is no treatment, no medication or vaccine for it. So the fundamental thing is to be careful about ourselves. While finding a cure is the end goal, testing is also important. Last month, the Revolutionary Guards unveiled a handheld device they said was capable of detecting an infected person from 100 meters away. But its effectiveness was criticized, and Iran's health ministry did not approve it for use. With no easy fixes, Scientists carry on with their research. How to end the pandemic remains an open question, and they intend to find the answer. Zain Basravi, Al Jazeera, Tehran.